Hello everybody, welcome back to another video of TV Talk here on the Vochek Experience, where idiots are still always us, always me, always. Anyway, um, in this video, I want to talk to you about a documentary series that I has just watched uh, not even five minutes ago uh, on Netflix. Um, it actually it was just released today on Netflix. It's called Challenger, The Final Flight. And this is a four-part, kind of like mini docu-series. Like I said, it's on Netflix. Um, just came out today uh, about the Challenger disaster. And it's got uh, a lot of uh, content and uh, behind the scenes of, you know, what went on. Um, a lot of uh, footage of the crew and stuff training. Uh, and of course, they also go through each crew member their history, their their childhoods, how they grew up, and, you know, how they got to be in the astronaut corps and all that stuff. And, and it just uh, comes together, like, as the shuttle program takes shape. Um, they even sh show uh, some scenes of the very first space shuttle launch of Columbia back in 81. And, uh, and they go through, you know, some succession of shuttle launches all leading up to the Challenger disaster. A good bit of this documentary is uh, focused on uh, Krista McAuliffe, who was the teacher who was supposed to go up to space and teach while up there. Uh, which, of course, we all know that didn't happen due to the disaster. But they have in-depth interviews with uh, NASA officials from back then, family members of the crew. And after the disaster, they talk about the investigation. Uh, they talk about the cover-up that NASA did. And of course, I'm not going to go too much into detail on all that stuff because I don't want to really spoil this documentary for you. It is a pretty fascinating uh, look into the Challenger disaster, especially if you are a big space buff like me. And of course, I think I said in a previous video that I actually watched Challenger explode live on TV when I was little. I was probably about five years old, maybe at the time, give or take. But I remember I used to watch every shuttle launch because that was like a big deal back then where every news channel would show it and broadcast the live launch and everything and I just remember sitting there like all excited yay another you know shuttle going up and then boom it blows up and uh, I remember like okay uh what just happened you know but of course being about five years old at the time I didn't know exactly exactly what it, what had happened you know, as I got older, of course, you know, I read on the subject, watched videos on the subject, and and all that stuff. And, you know, as I've grown up, come to know more about what happened. So, yeah, this uh, kind of sticks to me because, you know, me watching it live. Um, but like I said, I would highly recommend this documentary. It has four parts to it, each about... Uh, between 45 and 50 minutes long, so a good about four hours worth of uh, uh, information and uh, insider looks into the disaster. There was actually some things that uh, they talked about that I didn't even know about that happened. So, um, and of course, they show some footage of stuff that I don't ever remember seeing either, uh, especially with the crew training and and all that stuff, you know. Um, more in-depth on uh, Krista McAuliffe. Um, they talk about her backup uh, on the mission, the person that was her backup, and how she eventually uh, made it in space uh, years later uh, to kind of carry on the legacy of the teacher in space and, of course, to honor Krista McAuliffe's memory and but yeah, I, like I said, I just watched this documentary. It's on Netflix. It just premiered today. Um, so I would highly, if you got the time, I would highly recommend that you go and you watch this. It is very, very informative and I highly recommend it. 
So with that being said, uh, I would give this documentary, uh, you know, uh, 10 stars if I could, but that's just me because uh, I'm a big space buff. Um, but that's going to about do it for this video. I just wanted to touch upon this documentary, that it's out there, um, that I'm excited about it, that I enjoyed it, and, uh, and for me to recommend it to you and to others, and to honor the memory of all seven crew members who perished, uh, on that, uh, that fateful flight. Um, but with that, um, that's, like I said, that's going to about do it for this video. Uh, so as always, if you like this video, don't forget to hit that subscribe button, give me a thumbs up and hit that notification bell for notified of future videos. And if you want to follow me on Instagram, the link for that is down below. And if you want to follow me on TikTok, the link for that is also down below. And also, if you want to follow me on Twitter, the link for that is down below as well. So, uh, with that, I will see y'all in the next video. Bye.